All right, everybody, welcome to Alum. This is a, a, a game made by my a uh, couple of friends of ours. Um, the Orsi's uh, is an awesome family. Everything that they do is uh, pretty incredible stuff, and I'm happy to be a part of it. I don't really know much about the game. I know that they made it. I know that a lot of my friends are voice actors in it, and I know that everything that Orsi's touch turns to gold, and I'm excited. I've been, I'm really excited to play this. And uh, this is for all the people that, that you know, don't have Steam, that knew that they were making it and wanted to be a part of it. I wanted to know what would happen. So, all right, we're going to, I don't know how many people were in it to, you know, to make it and stuff. So, uh, just to give credit where credit is due. All right, let's see. <clears throat> now that I, I know that a lot of these were hand drawn. Unfeigned, altruist, move, speak, breathe, please. Remove the groping veils. How long? Don't let them sleep forever. Chapter One, Another Day. It's been three weeks since she last spoke. The vague consumed her, so subtle. Seems like only yesterday, she was so full of life. Where did this wretched epidemic come from? How long has it been spreading? It was more like a rumor. Something to call people who were bored with their lives. The vague. Mm. It was so easy to ignore. But now I see it. Now I care. When I look into her eyes, or hold her hand, I feel myself rummaging through a hopeless room, wandering through my heart, desperately looking for something to help her. Each thought seems more dull and vain than the last. The doctors are of no help. They have no idea what it is, where it came from, how it spreads, nothing. Someone has to know something. Each day that drifts by seems like a vacuum, drinking the color from my life. Have I got the vague? How long until I'm just like her? Esther. I love you. I'm heading to work, darling. I'll be back soon. Pressing E will light up exits in the current room. Okay. So let's see here. Steamy. <laughs> okay, so it's been a very long time since Hi, I've played. Sir. How are you doing today? Oh. Hey there, fella. I'm doing alright. Just enjoying my day off. It's nice to be out of those sewers for a change. But other than that, I guess it's just another day. What's your name, pal? Alum. Nice to meet you, Alum. My name is Joe Lomi Yorkshire the third. But you can call me Joe. Ha! Nice to meet you, Joe. I gotta get going. Hey. I dropped my doggone ID somewhere. If you happen to see it, grab it for me. Would you, buddy boy? Sure thing. Huh, okay. So it has been, as I was saying, it's been a very long time since I've played it. 
Uh, click adventure. Let me see here. I should check my mail before I get into anything. Okay. Like action. And then the mailbox. My mailbox. Ah. Bills. Junk. More junk. <laughs> hey, my new work ID finally came in. That is my inventory. You can also change your cursor with the right click action. Okay. Oh. Okay. That makes sense. Hey, Alum. How's it going? Ah, uh, Hodge. What are we looking at for the day? I'm gonna need to see an ID before we do business. Are you kidding me? Hodge, it's me. I work here with you every single day. Sorry, company policy. Go to items, click on the ID item, and then use it on Pike. How do I? Hey, Alum. Pike, for real. What deliveries do I have for today? I'm gonna need to see an ID before we do business. Hmm. Are you kidding me? Company policy. Go to items. Click the ID item. Use it on page. Hey, Alum. Pudge, for real. What deliveries do I have for today? I'm gonna need to see. Are you kidding me? Hmm. Company policy. How do I? Strange. Ah. Okay. Yep. Scroll it's the you. wheel. I've got one delivery from Miss Harkham at apartment 121, sector 44. That's just down those steps. You're practically there. Tell her I said hi. That's kind of cool. Alan, how's Esther been? She hasn't been over to visit lately. I'm not in the mood to talk, Hodge. Hmm. What was that? Hello? What's this? Dear Saw, we've received your message and we want to help. Meet me in the Cosmos Arcade. There's a cure for the vague. A cure for the vague? Hello? What's going on? Hmm. Could there really be a cure? I have to get to the arcade and figure out who this D person is. No, and it's an inventory. What was that, Alum? I'm not really sure. This note was lying on the ground back there. Hmm. <clears throat> Do you think someone has really found a cure for the vague? Beats me. Could just be a silly trick. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I don't know if I even believe in the vague, Alum. Well, I'm off to work, Bodge. See ya. If there's any chance the cure is real. I'd do anything to help Esther. Hopefully this D guy is still in the arcade. Hmm. Okay. So we're just gonna go over here. I do apologize, this is my very first solo recording. Was that a lurid? I must be seeing things. Hmm. That's a cycle through the tour. I guess no one's home. Hmm. Hello? I guess no one's home. Hmm. I'll just leave their package on the doorstep. Whoops. That's not good. Uh, oh. What? Uh, I'm from the Golden Stork. 
And I just wanted to let you know your package is in good hands. It should be here sometime today. Quit the jabber and shh. Just bring the package and I'll give you your tip. That's all you people care about anyway. Now get off my porch! <laughs> Thanks. Much of a porch. I guess. Okay, so we'll go get that. There's <coughs> a lot of dialogue in of this. Of course. I gotta get that down. Please, keep on thank you. It's for observational purposes only. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. Poor kid. I gotta get that thing down. Okay, so our first puzzle. Let's see here. He bought. Can I climb up to get that package down? Please. He bought the package. Tin cam with legs. Nothing but laws and order. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Go away! Jeez. Sucks it out here. I guess no one's home. <coughs> Let's see. Contraption. I'm not sticking my hand in there. It's the covering to the sewer entrance. I have no reason to mess with it. Report machine one one three eight nine fully functional. Positive check. Hmm. Just talk to this guy. Can't you just let me in? I need to meet someone in there. Look, I'd love to let you in. I just can't. Ten coins is the admission fee. No negotiation. Oh my god, is that Kim Shibley? Hello. Ah, uh, hi. Cosmo City, born and raised. Hmm. Mr. Glim has been doing a good job leading and keeping the city under control with the E-Bot. Okay. So, go in here. Maybe there's something else I can find. Locked. Hmm. Gotta get used to that inventory switch. Let's see. Not anything else. Let's see what that says. No. There we go. Is there anything about the booster? Okay. Hey, Alan. Uh, Haha. <laughs> Hi. Says it every time. Hmm. Mr. Glim's factory. The e-bots that protect the city are manufactured there. Mr. Glim brought a lot of great changes into Cosmos since he started leading. Hmm. It's a heat pillar. They keep the city nice and warm all year round. Outside of Cosmos, the land of Tide is pretty much a frozen tundra. Hmm. Interesting. Arms and arms. Three pipes lead down below. The three pipes lead down below. Okay, so can I do something? They're all securely bolted down. No. They're all securely bolted down. They're all securely no, bolted. No, 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 no. It's not what I want. Um the three pipes lead down below. Hmm.
That boulder seems to be loose. Let's grab that then. I think I figured it out. Let me see here. Ooh. Nice. A nice round boulder. Whirly do. Please, keep up. Thank you. It's more observational. Thank you. Boulder added to inventory. That's a nice boulder. I like that boulder. Put it down here. <laughs> Let's see what that did. No. That wasn't good. Okay, so I think we figured something out. We go back over here. Get this out of there. Let me see. Exit. There we go. Oh, I got it. There we go. So that's pipe number one. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, thank you, Mr. Glim. Thank you. The Lurids would have eaten my son alive. Your e bot saved him. No need to thank me. I'm only doing what anyone in my position of authority should do. Care for the people. You're the best leader our city has ever had. I'm completely in your debt. No, I'm just glad I could help. Thank you, Mr. Glimp. Have a good day, sir. Hmm. Talk of irrigation testing surface in chapter 24. Is that so? Perhaps that unruly swine Dashu is there. If he's left free to roam Cosmos, then this place will be in utter chaos. No. No order, no stability. Mm. The people of Cosmos need me. Those rogations are wasting their time with their precious false hope and lies. Those fools. Mm. See to it that they are sniffed out and captured. Make no mistakes. Yes, sir. Ooh. What is that? I'll stop them. What is that? Your strength is admirable, my friend. Cosmos needs me. Yes. Yes, they do. And the plot thickens. Okay. So back to throwing rocks down pipes. After that creepy little thing. Let's see, so part two. Uh who? There you go. Maybe that did <gasps> Did it? Did it? Yeah! No. Dang it. I was hoping that would do something. But it seems it seems to suck you in rather quickly with that with that little thing. That was pretty. That was pretty creepy. It's just like you see the thing sitting in the corner, and you you're, you're kind of watching the action, and you don't realize was that thing standing there the whole time? I I didn't know if it was. So that should probably when I watch this again, I'll probably go to see if that was sitting there the whole time because I don't I I wasn't sure. That's very interesting. And go! Did that do something? What? Hmm. Then... Wait a second. Wait. 
Is it all three? Wait, is wait. Nah. Okay. Let's, uh, there we go. Was that all three? I had to have been. Pipe two, pipe three. Let me just try it one more time just to see what happens. Okay. Hmm. That was uh, that's the one I just did. Hmm. Okay. Let's see here. Let me pick that up. Come on, pick it up. There you go. Sorry, I'm so slow. I haven't done anything like this in a long time. Seem the closest to doing something. Okay. Hmm. Maybe that's where I want to put it? Come on. Excellent. There we go. Don't want to catch my. I need something longer. Something longer. Wait. Can you just give a. Report received on one three eight nine. Wait a second. Hmm. It helps power this sector. I'm not sticking my hand in there. I'm not sticking my hand in there. It helps power this sector. Hmm. I don't want to catch my finger in there. I need something longer. Something longer. Hmm. Nah. Okay, so we're not gonna do that. I wonder what he's thinking about. Where could his parents be? Hmm. Nah. <laughs> you want the rock? Something longer. Oh. Cosmos City. Born and raised. Okay. Mr. Glim has been Great. Very rid of that. So maybe there's something in my house? There has to be a strange letter said there's a cure for the vague. Esther could be back to herself again. I have to get to the arcade and figure out who D is. Well, I didn't try to go into the arcade. So let me try that. So, that's, um, I'm gonna cut it here. I'm gonna just, it sucked me in. I, I was only supposed to record for like 15 minutes, but I, I'm up to 25 right now, and, um, I can't wait to keep going, and I'm a, I, I wanna know what happens now. It's, it's a little, I don't know, it's a, just a little slow to get around. And that's about it. But other than that, I, I really like the art, and I'm getting sucked into the the story a little bit. So let me see. Let's just give this a try and see what happens. Will I go in? Cosmos Arcade. There we go. Report. 
Oh, okay, so it's not gonna let me in there. But, I'm gonna cut it here, I'm having fun, and I can't wait to keep going. And, um, I'll see you guys in the next video.